Hey there and welcome to studio. This video is to show how to add a device group to your studio platform. You already know how to add a device to the studio platform, but perhaps you want to have all those devices uh, or multiple devices play one workout at a time. And ideally, maybe you want them sporadically throughout your gym or more likely, you'll want them playing in an area of your gym, for example, the treadmill room, if you're doing a, a running treadmill workout, or uh, the free weights room if, someone, if you have an upper body workout going. So let's just decide on how to create that group. So in this um, view you see right now, I have the single cast um, devices. These devices are not assigned to a group. Now I also have a, several set groups here, everything from Dave's studio room, Dave's test, group five, gym, gym group, and each of these have assigned devices to them. For example, if I were to play a um, cardio workout and I could have them play at these two, um, these two devices at one time by assigning it that workout to pair gym. So well, let's go ahead and add a new group, and then we'll add some devices to that group. So I'm going to add, um, like we were talking about, I'm going to say um, South Free Weights. And then description, you want to, if you're going to do several groups, so you might want to be really defined in your description. So I'm going to say Upstairs. Up, oh, sorry. Upstairs, far left. Add. Okay. Now I know um, the I have my group set. I want to go back to my devices and add some of those to that particular group. So I know I want the pair roller assigned to that new group. South free weights. Save. And I want, um, let's do test device for our purposes today and hit the edit button. Name of that device is already there. I'm going to put that into South Free Weights. Hit save. Now I can go back over here, go to South Free Weights and see my two uh, devices assigned to that group. So now I know that when I create a workout that I want for that area of my gym, I have these all set to go. Alternatively, once you're done and maybe you want to change this up and you want to put two different workouts on these, you can always pull out the devices back to single cast. So you can see that it's no longer there and it's, it's located here now again the pair roller. So it's really that simple. It's all about just selecting the edit button and putting that device into a set group that helps your purposes and gets your workouts um, cast to the area of your gym that possibly has all the equipment and space needed um, that you want. Um, if you have any questions at all, please reach out to us at support at Pair Sports and we can connect and I could show you this um, and guide you through it to get you going. Thank you again. Support at Pair Sports. Have a good day. Bye-bye.